Young Conservatory, Cranberry Coast Concerts, and Firehouse Projects support and promote creation, performance, recording, and education in the arts in South Florida, New England, and globally. This program is supported in part by the Miami-Dade County Department of Cultural Affairs and the Miami Foundation for a Greater Miami. And we're back! How you doing? Seasons greetings, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and anyone who might feel a little left out. That includes you. Welcome to a completely, again, apolitical, without politics, non-confrontational, because we don't want that kind of stuff, family-friendly, international holiday celebration, part du. All right, that's the second part of the trio. All right, that's part du. So peace on earth, goodwill towards men. And again, I've got your hosts, Kirk Whipple and Marilyn Morales. I, that's me, am Steve Bruner. Who? Steve Bruner, your master of ceremonies. We're kicking off the middle part of our trilogy with Craig Wheeler's magical voice and ukulele on Robert Alex Anderson's Mele Kalikimaka. That was pretty good, I think. That's Merry Christmas in Hawaiian, folks, because I cannot just butcher the English language. I can butcher the Hawaiian language, too. Mele Kalikimaka is a thing to say on a bright Hawaiian Christmas day. That's the island Fantastic use of the holiday ukulele. You can't tell the difference just by looking at it, but you can by the feel. So, we are now going to have two more poems celebrating the winter solstice. Just like in the first show, it was wonderful to see Maureen, our resident bard. Please welcome Maureen Hurley. Betrayals of the mind begin innocuously enough. Small warning signs you pay no heed to. They're merely trifles, but they steadily accumulate until one day you're on the wrong side of a locked gate. You misplaced the key long ago, and there is no spare to be found anywhere. Not for love, nor money, nor wishes made of horsehair and remembrance. Just an attic filled with dying stars and an insurmountable debt that cannot be repaid. The ritual of hope long since misplaced. When the mood is right, I will deliberately take a wrong turn 
and allow myself to get a little more lost on winding back roads. Not knowing where I am is part of the thrill. Wrong roads become the right roads. And my eyes drunk with joy. Very excited for round two here. So thanks for including me. Look, I dressed up in a, in a tie. I didn't, I wanted the show different. I'm like a reverse stripper. I'm putting on more clothes as we go through. That's the same shirt, right? Oh, this is my favorite shirt. I don't think I've told you that uh, I've worn this shirt a lot and uh, it used to be white, but uh, I spilled a little club soda on it and I had to use Merlot to get it out. All right, I'm going to leave this next one to you guys while I go and have a cup of coffee. All Thanks, right. Steve. Thank you. Thank you. Well, it's a real pleasure to introduce to all of you this next selection from our recording, Elemental Portraits. And uh, please get in touch with us if you'd like the full recording. We'll be presenting information about that in the new year as well. And it's 11. Nocturnes. Nocturnes. For two pianos. Yeah. And we picked one that is dedicated to the woman who performed our wedding ceremony, Ila Benavides. And this piece is entitled, Ila Deep Ocean Wave.
That's wonderful to see that the hosts know what they're doing. Isn't that great? I love it. And hey, make sure you try to get their album, or that just shows how old I am, their CD, Elemental Portraits, and it's fabulous. 11 Nocturne. I can't even count that high. That's pretty good. We've got Tom Casale, bassist of the CCC Cool Jazz Trio, which you might have seen in the first show. And if you didn't, get, you, go back and see it. I'm telling you. He's playing guitar in this piece because uh, he was the bassist in the life. He's just multi-talented. His wife and daughter, we want to give them a shout out of thanks because they allowed him a few minutes to record this piece in peace which uses looping techniques, so here comes O oh Christmas Tea. Christmas tea, oh Christmas tea.
Ah, uh, well, apparently in the last introduction, I missed the R in O Christmas Tree. So we're all drinking Christmas tea. That's the way it goes. So cheers to you. Cheers and uh, my good man. Moving right along, Kirk sent me a fabulous script, but a couple words I wasn't sure of. So this one is performing on the modern Chinese instrument, underline, question mark, question mark, question mark, because he didn't think I could pronounce it. And then he never gave me the word, but you're going to learn it. We're all going to learn it together. That's but, how, how it's written in Chinese characters. Underline, <laughs> question mark, question mark. <laughs> well, I can't wait to hear it, you guys. And Donald Kwan created the music for the TV show Relic Hunter, something I've actually seen. So how wonderful to have that little closure. I wonder who wrote this. Now I know. Donald Kirk and Carlton met in 1981 at Wellesley Women's College production of Hair. And I'm not sure if we mentioned this in the front. Holy Toledo, look at that thing. Grab a hold, people. That's <laughs> and did we already say that Kirk was the star of Hair at Wellesley Women's College in 1981? Apparently we did, but it can't be said enough when I you're next to the host. Absolutely. So let's enjoy this reunion pajama party. See you in a bit. Wow! Hey oh there! God. God. Oh my God! God. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my God! We talk to each other on Facebook, but I know. Real deal. I know. This is the first time, and I have to say this for everybody watching this: that uh, Carlton and Donald and I have been in contact at the same time on the same screen in <laughs> over four decades. <laughs> oh no, my God! It's like, like we're not it's lying. Mind it's mind like forty years. It's blood. It's freaking. Keep it. Keep keep the comments oh, clean. Hey. This is PG. This is. PG. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> we, have amazing. Amazing. we have editing. Amazing. We have editing capabilities, but we don't want to use them too much. But if you look just over my head, that hippie with his arms in the air is me. Oh yeah, that's right. And let's see, you, you guys can probably have to move out of the way so you can find yourselves in the cast photo here. This is a fun one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this was the near naked scene. That was the one because uh, um, uh, Paul had the hots for me. So he was, he put me in the center. You too? Ah. Gosh. Yeah. Yeah, see, right there. Yep, right I was the main there. one. <laughs> you, you vixen. He told me he had the hots for me, and I was so strong so he <laughs> on the bottom. <laughs> By the way, do you remember that uh, trip we all took to college and we sang Lithuanian tunes? No. <laughs> so that's Wendy Liebman when she was in college because she was in college at Wellesley. Yeah. And uh, she's now a world famous comedian. Uh, yeah. This is probably the first time my hair has been that almost that long. <laughs> you can watch <laughs> porn on the way from English to history class and not even get pegged for it. I hate you, <laughs> you young kids. Hello, Craig. <laughs> this, is, this is my husband, Craig. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hi, Don. <laughs> And Craig, Craig, do you, do you have any do you have any jokes yes. for us tonight that can be repeated in front of family members? No. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. My world sir, my best friend, is always on, just so I can always turn to it and go. And I. Oh uh, my have... goodness! You know something? I've actually been waiting forty years to hear a comment like that. My world sir is always on. It's always on. <laughs> it's always on. I like here from Miami. We think you're living in the day after tomorrow. That's right. Well, boy, we are. <laughs> <laughs> like that one. I don't have to plug it in. <laughs> and, and, and Craig has one that he's going to play for us a little bit later, too. 
It has a few less strings, though. <laughs> Much less complicated. Say the name once more, and we're all going to repeat it. Gu Zheng. Gu Zheng. Gu Zheng. Gu Zheng. Gu Zheng. That's it. <laughs> you see, this is not only entertaining tonight, this is <laughs> educational. educational. So we are going <laughs> to listen now to Donald Kwan playing a lovely piece, and everybody say it at the same time on the Gujang. Here we go. <laughs> Let's enjoy. was called today is Gujang day and a day before Christmas which brings me to this instrument it's a cardboard uh, got at the uh, Goodwill um, and I'm gonna play a little well I think you'll know this one Merry Christmas, everyone! Oh man, Donald, that was that just was magical. Beautiful. It was beautiful. Wonderful, my friend. And, and you know, this is what I have to say. You know, for, for people who aren't in these circles, we are truly blessed because 
artists, I think, know the best people. And that's what that what has been such a blessing in our lives, you know. Um, so again, Donald, thank you, thank you for that. And I tell you what, when this whole COVID nightmare is over, we are all going to invade your house in Toronto, and we're going to do some cooking together, man. Yeah, yeah, for sure. and some music. And yeah, all of it. It's it, it, it's the next stage of uh, our existence. <laughs> yeah, and we we are gonna play that Wurlitzer that is always on. It's gonna be like dun 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 dun. You know, thank you guys from the from the bottom of our hearts for sharing your talents with us on our holiday international spectacular. And uh, we look look forward to the next time we get to meet and reminisce again. Thanks, everybody. My pleasure. Catch you guys very very soon. And uh, Merry Christmas. Licka, licka, micka, 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 maka, maka, maka. And Happy New Year, everybody. Same to you. Leading roles in the 2022, always remember live world theatrical premiere. I can hardly wait. Mauricio Tenor is from Mexico. Marinel Soprano is from Puerto Rico. We'll see how I did on that. I'm not really sure. I, I added the, a little bit. And after her dog, Rocky, her husband is the second most important man in her life. So please welcome Marinel and Mauricio. I have the honor of introducing now the creator and two of the stars of Always Remember, the musical about the Cuban American experience, Mauricio Villanueva Espinosa and Marinel Cruz. Oh, that's beautiful. Hi. Yes. <laughs> and of course, Marilyn Morales. Yes, and I have the honor of introducing you, the arranger. Yay! Wonderful show. That's me. Yeah, yeah. Always remember. So what? What's happening? What's happening, you two? Yay! Well, uh, what can I say? Well, <laughs> it's I'm, I'm it, it, there's there's well that's that's my um, the picture of my theater in in uh, my hometown in, in Mexico, San Luis Potosí Teatro de la Paz, which uh, it happens to be like that still uh, empty. But it's a beautiful, beautiful background, you know. Beautiful. Uh, but I, yeah, but uh, I, I don't know about Marinelle, but uh, over here uh, with my family, we, we've been uh, hanging around in the house, you know, converting the house in, <laughs> into a studio, uh, an office, a daycare, and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and a home. So, yes, uh, we, we understand that you have a very demanding boss, yes? <laughs> <laughs> a three-year-old boss. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, we, are going, we are working in our new normal, you know. In my case, I'm, I have been teaching. Um, what I what I, I can say, inventing, because we have to reinvent, you know, ourselves with this uh, new situation, no? Mm. But yeah, same like my Mauricio, spending a lot of time in my house. <laughs> and we've been seeing on Facebook, too, for, for anybody who isn't on Facebook, you should get on Facebook, if for no other reason than to become acquainted with Rocky. Oh, yes, I love Rocky. Wow. Rocky yes, is my baby. Yes. He, and he is the official mascot of Always Remember. We've, oh, yes. We've all adopted oh, him. Oh, yes, yes. Rocky. He's such a kitty. Rocky. 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 <laughs> you know, say I... Oh. Say hi, say hi. Uh, this recording was made gosh it was made in february we were just rehearsing yes. and at the piano and uh so but we yes we hope that we were going to be able to premiere it on uh, march 26 but uh because of the COVID, we ended up having to cancel it and now we're mm. trying we're doing our best to premiere it in, on march well maybe march of 2022 2022, 2022. Right. So here it is, the goodbye song from Always Remember, uh, featuring Marinel Cruz and Mauricio Villanueva Espinosa. Oh. Mm. 
say the word. And no matter how we may try, there's nothing quite as hard as when we say Could you tell us a little bit about your business? Uh, we're going to display the link here so that people can find you. Tell us, tell us what they can find there. Of course, Kirk. So yeah, um, I have a, I have product for uh, natural products for uh, skincare and makeup, and you can find those products on pharmacy uh, www.pharmacyus/marinercruz.com. And yeah, you will be, you will love the product because they are good quality, quality, inexpensive, and yeah, natural. <laughs> and Mauricio, uh, uh, how about a little bit of a message about uh, what's happening with you and the links that are coming up now? Now you can, uh, you can watch or hear or listen to my new podcast uh, on the name of Corrompiendo Generos which is break, Breaking the Janners. Uh, and why, why the name is because uh, it's, a, it's a show uh, that talks about what the world music, the history of the world music uh, and the benefits of it and the diversity 
uh, and all, all positive things that I'm always trying to find in, in the music and, uh, and you know, and in the unity of the music. So you can, you can watch now, uh, go straight to my, my, uh, my Spotify uh, channel, which is Co Corrompiendo Generos, and, uh, and start listening to it. It's really, really, really interesting. We are having a lot of artists, uh, interviews. I interview uh, people from Mexico, from Norway, from Belgium, uh, from, 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 this, from Miami. Uh, artists that have been, you know, uh, working uh, and, and mostly ambassadors of the world music, of La Musica del Mundo. Uh, so uh, I recommend it pretty much. Really for the it. yeah for yeah. the Hispanic people because uh, we don't have that and now we will we will have the chance to, to for people to listen to it and I hope in the future many other people bring more more of this of this topic. Thank you both for being a part of our international holiday celebration today. We wish both of you and mm -hmm. yours just the merriest Christmas, Happy New Year, and all good things for 2021. Yes. Thank you. you. Happy holidays. Okay. Thank you, thank holidays. you. Happy holidays to you too, and to all the people that are that are watching. And and I'm looking forward to to come back to always remember and make it happen. And keep cool. those voices in shape. Yes, yes. Be safe. <laughs> all right. Take care. Catch you later. Take care. Bye. And now is the time where I get to say a little bit of background about Marilyn and Bassinia who met at the Jose Iturbi International Piano Competition, which is in Valencia, Spain. While Kirk was in Moscow, not Idaho, but the other one, the bigger one, uh, competing in the Tchaikovsky International Piano Competition. And you people have no idea how long it took me to say all those words. Iturbi, Tchaikovsky, ay ay ay. Uh, and her birthday, and we're talking about Bassinia, and we're talking about Marilyn too, and Kirk. They're, all their birthdays are in December, but Bassinia uh, is in December, and it's snowing outside and inside her studio in Moscow, Russia. Only in Russia. Wow! Hello, Bassinia! Oh, how are you doing? Oh! Hello, hello my the, friends! <laughs> all the way around the world in Moscow. Oh. We, took this picture just for you behind us in, in honor of you joining us today. <laughs> but you have That's the really thing. funny. Yeah, you I have a I have a special pictures for you behind me, but it's natural. Tell so us. you can wow. see you can see all Moscow above me. The university is just uh, not two steps, but you can see it. Uh -huh. And maybe you can even see the snow. Oh wow! Downstairs wow. with the children and parents who is walking, because it's nice weather. We call it New Eve weather when the snow is sparkling and so nice. It's December now. I love this month most of all because it's uh, the month of my birthday. I not only mine, birthday. not That's only birthday. mine. Yes. <laughs> yes. We are all Sagittarius. Yes. So, of course, I chose the piece of uh, Pyotr Ilyich Tchaikovsky from the seasons. Beautiful. What do you mean I will perform? December.
Oh my gosh, you play so beautiful. Here's hoping that 2021 is a wonderful year for all of us. And uh, Basenia, thank you so much for joining us on our international holiday special. You've helped us to make it truly international. Yes. Uh, с Новым Годом, с, с Ханукой, с Рождеством. Всех поздравляю с праздниками и желаю большого здоровья, счастья, любви и успехов в Новом Году. Спасибо! Спасибо! Thank you so much, from Moscow. Katerine plays all of the sexes. Wait, oh, that's, that's saxes. Sorry. And is an educator. I'm not sure in which one. But Mark, who is also an educator, uses all of the keys on his piano frequently. Now, wait, Kurt, did I miss anything? I'm solo! Thank you. 
This is Elizabeth Eccles from Chesapeake, Virginia, soprano, educator, choir director, and all-around angel. And you'll know that because she'll be singing Amazing Grace, which was recorded during season two of Cranberry Coast Concerts at the Wareham Public Library. Yes, I am saying Wareham right. Look it up. She's also with her son, David Eccles, cellist, educator, orchestra director, and clinician, as well as a special guest star, Michael Simpson, tenor vocalist, violist, who plays Miss Viola when he plays her, uh, educator, orchestra director, and clinician. Please welcome them all. Oh, it was a wonderful experience. To see the faces of the children and the parents uh -huh. was, was very uh -huh. gratifying. Uh -huh. And it was a delightful day for a, a wonderful uh, experience in the library. Exactly. They were so responsive to the performances, and that just makes it, you know, kind of inspires us to kick it up to a higher gear because you can tell you've got your audience. They're really enjoying it. Yeah, and you could also tell for some of those kids that was their first time hearing live music. They heard live music. They heard singing. They heard piano playing. They heard mm -hmm. string players. It was mm -hmm. their and, and to have it that intimate and, and up close and interactive was was right. was oh, was so much fun.
so beautiful. I know where I was. Well, she's. I was only- in the audience. I was one of the little kids. You know. <laughs> <laughs> she's still a little kid. <laughs> Thanks a lot, dear friends, and look forward to when we can do this again <laughs> for real. In person, for sure. Thank awesome. You. Thank you. Happy holidays. Merry Thank Christmas. You. Happy holidays. Happy have holidays. a happy and blessed new year. Indeed. Thank you, too. Okay. All righty. Bye-bye. 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 Toledo, who, who do we have here? Hey there, Steve. My name is Bernie. Hey, Bernie. Ber- Bernie what? Bernie D. Bear. Bernie D. Bear. Everybody out there, and, and Bernie too, go fill up your popcorn buckets, pour another cup of eggnog. And salmon. Oh. <laughs> and salmon. And then tune in to our finale. Uh, Bernie, That's uh, uh, that means the end. Number three of three, coming up soon. Adios.